Hello Youtubers, I'm Parwais and this is our fourth video in Learn Django 2.1. In the previous video we have learned about apps concept in Django and we have created our uh, first app that's called News in the previous video. In this video I'm going to show you how you can configure your URLs in Django. So there are two ways that you can do URL configuration in Django. Uh, uh, the first way is that you can do it in the uh, main urls.py if you check this we have uh, right now we have just admin uh, let me run my uh, development server and uh, cd my project and python manage.py run server and right now we have just uh, admin uh, admin url but uh, yeah this is our development server let me just copy this and uh, paste it in my browser and it's going to okay now this is our uh, Django uh, page uh, there now there are two ways that you can do this the first way is in the main URLs dot by that I'm going to show you in this video and the second way is that you can do separately in the apps and after that after that you can connect that in your main URLs URLs dot by so uh, in this video so uh, if you check if you open your news dot uh, news app uh, I have created before if you don't know uh, for creating app you can just simply uh, if you want to create app uh, you can simply mm, let me create a new session you can simply uh, python uh, manage dot by start app and after that you can give your app name uh, you can watch the previous video I have uh, explained that in that video so uh, now if you open your app in here we have a views dot by this is the place that we can add our views uh, uh, for example you can render your HTML uh, files through the view so right now we don't want to talk about rendering HTML files uh, we are going to just uh, we are going to just um, make a simple uh, a simple text and uh, so now I'm going to define a method in here uh, def home and give a request and also you need to import uh, from Django dot shortcuts import HTTP response uh, HTTP response sorry HTTP response okay and now in here we are going to return uh, HTTP response and uh, h2 and the h2 tag I'm going to write uh, simple text for example uh, welcome to Django application like this and uh, in the later videos you will watch that in here we instead of HTTP response we will render a template okay now we have created our home method but if we run in here if we refresh our Django app you see that there is uh, no change after creating this you need to map this in your urls.py so I'm going to open this in here uh, pat right pat and uh, you can give it for example in here we have give at main so if we go to the admin backslash admin like this okay but uh, I don't want to give uh, I'm sorry because okay let me run my server okay because in here we uh, but uh, in here uh, I'm going to uh, leave it by default uh, as index and uh, after this you need to import something in here for example we are going to import from uh, page and sorry from news from our news app from this news app we are going to import views because in the view we have our home method and from 
import views and in here uh, I'm going to just give it uh, news dot views like this and also you can give a name uh, this name is uh, for the linking and for further videos you can I will uh, give you I will give you explanation for this now uh, we have uh, created this and now if I refresh this uh, Let me uh, uses and defined. Okay, sorry. Uh, yeah, in here I have made a problem. It is uh, like this. You can, you should give it. Uh, let me from uh, news dot views import home and uh, like this. And after this, uh, just in here, you can give uh, uh, your mm, function name that is home, like this. Okay. Uh, we have imported from news.views from this file. From this file, we are going to import home. In the home, we have a simple text that is welcome to Django application. So, uh, if we had a template in here, we can do that so now we have uh, created this and let me refresh it now you can see uh, welcome to Django application uh, if you change this for example in our view uh, I'm going to change this to hello world and you can see uh, what is the problem yeah you can see it's now hello world uh, so uh, also you can do this for right now I have one app uh, you can for example uh, in this app I want to add another uh, let me add this uh, diff uh, diff contact and uh, and request you can simply return uh, HTTP response well, let me just copy this return HTTP response and I'm going to tell it this is our this is our contact contact page and in here just change the title uh, this uh, text to this is our index okay uh, now let me just open my urls.py in here I'm going to add another URL so just copy this and uh, paste it in here now you need from news.views import home also you need to import uh, a contact like this and just change this to contact and give it a name of contact and also like this contact okay uh, now if I run this let me save this now we have this is our index and if I go to the contact you can see this is our contact page you, this is contact and this is our index index and uh, contact you can do uh, like this stuff uh, this was our first uh, this was our first video on URL configuration. Uh, in the next video, we will do uh, the second part. If you have any question, please let me know. And for the further videos, don't forget subscription of my channel.